If you've studied chemistry, then you'll know that potassium is a chemical element that has the symbol K in the periodic table. It's an essential mineral that helps our muscles and nerves to communicate with one another, keeps our hearts functioning healthily, and helps nutrients and waste move through our cells. Potassium helps to prevent strokes, high blood pressure, cramping, arrhythmias, and reduces the risk of kidney stones. We can usually get enough potassium from our food and not getting enough is quite rare, but taking certain medications can affect our potassium levels. A potassium test to measure the amount of potassium in your blood might be needed if your potassium levels are thought to be too high or too low. The level of potassium might be low after an illness or may need to be checked if there's an irregular heartbeat. The level of potassium may need to be checked if there's a kidney problem, if there's high blood pressure or diabetes. Having too much potassium can affect your heart muscle, although this is not common. A potassium test can be a prevention and prevention is always better than cure. Potassium is available in a supplement, but it's easy to give your potassium level a boost through your diet. Fruits such as bananas, melons, apricots and oranges and dried fruits such as prunes, raisins and dates are a great source of potassium. Try adding spinach, broccoli, peas, sweet potatoes, zucchini and cucumber to your diet as all of these are a good source of potassium. Nuts, wholemeal bread, bran, brown rice and seeds are also a good source, not forgetting beans such as pinto beans, kidney beans, lima beans, white beans and lentils. Fish such as tuna, cod, halibut, trout and shellfish all contain potassium and meats such as turkey, chicken and beef also contain a good supply as well as milk. So there are plenty of ways to ensure you keep your potassium levels on an even and healthy level.